Bree. But I mean, you're lucky that you don't have to take care of me anymore, now that I'm here. What? Well, I wanted to look after you. Why? Hmm, it seems like it'd been fun. Come on, come on. <sniffs> Doesn't this room kind of smell like a girl? What? Oh, uh, does it? Don't tell me you're using the private room to your advantage of bringing girls in here. I'm not doing that. Yeah, I mean, they're the ones coming in here. I'm gonna text your mom that you're doing naughty things. Please, don't do that! Apparently, Shizuku enjoys messing around with me like this. I can't complain because she's been helping me out a lot, though. Anyway, I'm coming here again tomorrow, so I'll bring more stuff. Thanks. Maybe even something you need at night. What? Hey, I don't need that! I'm just kidding. But I'll make sure to text your mom that you're living a productive nightlife and need things like that. You're evil! Shizuku went home joking like that. But Michiru-san and Nao-san came into the room right after. Kentaro-kun, who was that? It seemed like you two were super close. What? Um... Why are you too angry? Because, because! I didn't see my Kentaro-kun for a little bit, and now he's someone else's! That kind of gives me the tingles, though. Hmm? I feel like they're misunderstanding something. It seems like these two think that Shizuku is my girlfriend or something. Huh? huh? Your, Your cousin? cousin? Yes. Her name is Shizuku Sakamoto, and she's my cousin from my mom's side. We're the same age, and we're super close. She was supposed to come over to my house to look after me while my parents were away. That means... that means... 